Laura? Laura? Mom. Where's Laura? Where is she? She's gone. Gone? Where? She just walked out on you, child. She just walked out on you. I could have told you the minute I laid eyes on her. You sent her away. I never did. She just walked out on you, child. Laura! Jean! You, Jean! Laura! Jean, you know what I'd do if I were you? I'd just be a good sport about it, that's what. I wouldn't let on that it affected me one bit. I'd write to her just as big as you please and laugh about the whole thing. Oh, God, Mama, please, leave me alone. Why? I'd be ashamed to let a girl get my goat like that. When you get older, you'll see you'll look back on this and just laugh. You'll see. You'll go to college next year, and you won't remember a thing about it. Well, I told you I'd sold that Stumptown property, and I have. This year's term has started already, but next year... Oh, no! No, I've wasted enough time! What, what are you talking about? There's plenty of... Mom! 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 Mom, what is it? What more do you want from me? You want to strangle and drown me completely? Do you want more string? Just tell me what you want! Do you want more property? Do you want the town? Is that it? What are you talking about, boy? If I hadn't tried to accumulate a little something, none of you'd have a roof to call your own. A roof to call our own? Good God, I never had a bed to call my own. I never had a room to call my own. I never had a quilt to call my own that wasn't taken from me to warn the mob that rocks on that porch and grumbles. You can sneer at the borders if you like. No, I can't. There's not breath or strength enough in me to sneer at them all I like. God, ever since I was this high and you sent me to the store for the groceries, I used to think, this food is not for us. It's for them. Mama, making us wait until they've eaten. All these years feeding us on their leftovers! Do you know what it does to us? When it's you we wanted for us. You we needed for us. Why? Why? They don't hurt me like the rest of you do. They wouldn't talk to me the way you are. Because they don't care! They're strangers! They don't give a damn about you. They'll talk like this about you behind your back. I've heard them do that plenty. What? What, what do they say about me? <laughs> what does it matter what they say? They say, does it matter you what I say? <laughs> now, Mama, but it won't do you any good. I've done as much work for my wages as you deserve. I've given you fair value for your money. I thank you for nothing. What are you talking about? I said I thank you for nothing, but I take that back. Yes, I have a great deal to be thankful for. I give thanks for every hour of loneliness that I've had here. For every dirty cell you ever gave me to sleep in. For the ten million hours of indifference. And for these two minutes of cheap advice. 
If there is a just God in heaven, you will be punished! Oh, there is! I'm sure there is because I have been punished! By God, I shall spend the rest of my life getting my heart back, healing and forgetting every scar you put upon me when I was a child. The first move I ever made after the cradle was to crawl for the door, and every move I ever made since has been an effort to escape. And now, at last, I am free from all of you! <laughs> and I shall get me some order out of this chaos. I shall find my way out of it, yet though it takes me 20 years more, alone. No, Jing, Jing, you're not leaving. Jing. You weren't looking, were you? I've already gone.